Hello and welcome to Edinburgh Watch Company. My name is Jonathan and on today's video I'm going to talk to you about and show you a very, very rare watch from Tag Heuer. Now you can find out more about this watch by visiting our website at edinburghwatchcompany.co.uk and there you'll find some photographs, technical specification and pricing, but of course if there's anything more you'd like to know then please just give me a call directly. So what have we got here? Well, we have here a limited edition Tag Heuer Monaco Caliber 12. Now this watch is one of only 1,200 in the world. It was made and distributed by Heuer in 2012 as they celebrated becoming an official partner of the Automobile Club de Monaco. Now that is obviously quite an exciting thing for them and they therefore brought out one of two limited edition watches of which this is one of them. So the Monaco, of course, needs no introduction. It's a watch that's been out now for 50 years. In fact, we recently had the very limited edition red dial one, which is one of the series of five that's made um, by, by Hoyer. They're really just gorgeous watches, and this one is in fact the first one we've had in five years, and I doubt whether we'll see another one. So for those of you that love motorsport, perhaps you've got a special memory of being to Monaco, maybe it's a classic Monaco or the, the, the modern, um, it's a very special place in itself. So that is this particular watch. Now, um, this particular one is, the, is almost what they call the Steve McQueen dial on it. So it has that black dial. And traditionally where the Monaco watches have the red hands on them, like the second hand, this is replaced by orange. And as we'll see later when we get a close up view, that's also runs through to the strap as well with little bits of uh, orange detail on it. So really overall quite a special watch. This particular watch is number 88. So it's 88 out of 1200. So one of the earlier ones made. And I've, until we came across this one, I've never even seen one. So. I think it's pretty special. Now, this video we're shooting of it today, we've just got it. Uh, we're gonna send it away. It's gonna get a very, very light polish just to make sure it's absolutely perfect, but it really has only been worn a, a handful of times and it's part of a sort of Hoya collection that we've just got. Um, you'll also see we're gonna shoot a video. We've managed to get one of the Gulf Monaco's as well in black, which is a really special one. It's a, it's a caliber 36. So, you can probably tell if you've seen these videos before. Um, we obviously do all the famous brands, the Rolex, Cartiers and Breitlings, but I love these special edition watches. You know, I buy these watches because I'm passionate about watches. I really only buy watches I like that I think you'll like. And this is no exception to that. So I think this would be a great treat to yourself. Maybe a member of the family, an 18th or 21st uh, anniversary, something just for that petrol head in your life, it would be a really cool one. So let's go and have a closer look at the watch. So here we have it. Um, let's just work top down. First of all, the sapphire crystal on this is absolutely stunning. And if I just turn it there on its side, you can just see the thickness of it there. And just the angles, it's just a beautifully piece of engineered glass that just makes this Monaco is so special. So here we are, as I say, the black dial on it here, and you can see at the bottom the circle there, the Automobile de Club Monaco. And then the hands, normally red, you can see an orange with the silver subdials. You've got the date function here, and you have the chronograph buttons there. Very easy to operate and great timekeeping with this um, caliber 12 movement. So it really is quite special. You've got the Hoya branding and the Monaco at the top there. Just looking at the side there, you can see here and it's satinized finish to the case and it's polished down here on the lugs. The strap's really, really nice. Again, it just shows how rarely this watch has been worn. The original strap that on it, it's like an alligator strap there with the uh, orange contrast stitching on it too, which really pulled out the orange from the dials here. The strap itself is mounted to a deployant class there, so this just very, very easily clip shut there, so making it very easy to take on and off your wrist. You've got that Tag Heuer logo there, and just gently pushing these two buttons there, and it opens up. To adjust it's very easy, you just have to go like this 
and then this just slides in and out so you can adjust it to suit. On the back of the watch here, I'll actually see if I can take this out and that will just show you um, what it looks like. Um, you can see here this wonderful caliber 12 movement crystal back. You can see it's limited edition stamped on the back there, a number 88 out of 1200. So that's a very, very uh, limited production of the watch. Should you wish to take it uh, swimming, it's also um, waterproof down to 100 meters as well. But I'd perhaps uh, encourage you to consider uh, getting a, a different strap if you, were, if you were going to do that. So there we are, that's the Monaco, and I'll just show you, show you shortly what it looks like on the wrist too. So here we are, you can see it on my wrist here. Um, I've got about an eight inch wrist, so it sits very, very comfortably, very, very easy to adjust. And it is just, it just looks absolutely brilliant. Um, I think also with a leather strap as well, you can get a really tight fit to your wrist, so it doesn't sort of rattle around on your wrist like sometimes you get with a, a braceleted watch. Um, but I think it's just, just looking at it here, again, it's so, to look through that sapphire crystal, it's a very clear, dial to read, um, as I say, with that automobile Club de Monaco um, branding on the bottom of the dial is rather nice. Date window is very easy to read. And I just think the colors of the orange, the hands and sub dials, the orange strap, the whole thing works really, really well. Um, you can see there that just gives you a perspective as well as um, thickness on the wrist. So there we go. That brings us to the end of today's video. Um, just to recap on what we've got here, this is the Tag Heuer Monaco Caliber 12, number 88 out of 1200, a celebration of Heuer's sponsorship of the Automobile de Club Monaco. So perhaps just the perfect watch if you love your, love your Tag Heuer's, you love the Monaco as a model, and you maybe have an association or an interest in all things motorsport that goes on down at the, the circuit to Monaco. Thanks for watching today. Loads more videos coming on soon. Remember, if you're on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, eBay, we're on all of these channels, so please do follow us. And if you'd like to be notified of all the latest videos coming along, then please just click there. That'll subscribe you to our channel. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.